Among the options I did was geography, history, and additional mathematics. But I ended up doing accounting. So what does it take for you to study accounting? All that you need to do are your five O levels, even without having done principles or bookkeeping. Because when you come to Zika's, we will start with the very basics in accounting and you can end up training to become an accountant. And I wish to indicate to you that the programs that we have under the School of Business, particularly the Accountants Department, can give you an opportunity to get exemptions from professional accountancy qualifications like ACCA, Zika, and CIMA. So indirectly, when you do our degrees, to be specific, we have Bachelor of Accounting and Finance. We also have Bachelor of Accountancy. Those programs will give you exemptions when you decide to do your professional qualification. So indirectly, we can say that doing the Zika's accounting program will be another route into your ACCA, another route into your Zika, another route into CIMA. So they are exciting programs that will give you a very solid foundation for you to become an accountant, for you to become an auditor in industry. You will agree with me that every business requires an accountant. So the opportunity are immense. You can work in government, you can work in industry, you can also be your own boss providing accounting services to various businesses. So welcome once again to Zika's University, even as you think through the programs. So uh, I'll make a presentation uh, as part of uh, the School of Business and uh, the department uh, the Department of Banking and Finance. Now, before I tell you which uh, what programs fall under this uh, school, I uh, just want to give you a word of encouragement. Uh, when you come to the university, uh, what you're trying to get is a passport. Now, a passport for what? You know what a passport is, right? What does a passport do? It allows you to go places, right? Yeah. Now, there are different kinds of passports, right? You know, some passports, when you get that passport, you have uh, problems uh, going to the places you desire to go. But let me assure you, when you get the Zika's passport, it will take you places. Amen? It will take you places. Because why do I say you're getting a passport? From where you're coming from, your destiny was defined by your parents. They told you what to do. Am I right? When to study. But when you come to university, the passport you get, you'll be setting your own destiny. So the kind of passport you get is also very important. The Zika's passport, which is a top class passport, Zika's being a tier one university. And uh, the School of Business, which is the premier school of business in the country, like no other. And the de Department of Banking and Finance, which is a department that will allow you to get uh, a premier passport, because from this department, you get a passport that will allow you to get a lot of money, a Bachelor of Science in Banking and Finance. This will allow you to join uh, the banking industry, the finance industry. Uh, you can do so many things in life, right? Eh? But all of us need to have money. And if you have this paper or this degree, this qualification, you'll be taking care of people's money and your own. So it'll be very important in society. Apart from uh, you being a banker or in finance, we've got other programs also. Uh, we've got uh, a Bachelor of Science in uh, Finance and Investment Management. Now this one, ah, this one you'll be a high flyer. Because you know where you can go? You can be an investment banker. Have you ever heard of the investment banking? Yeah, very prestigious, right? And a lot of money again. Apart from that, what other programs we have under this department? Uh, we've got a Bachelor of Arts in Financial Services. Now this one will allow you to be everywhere. You can work for the Ministry of Finance. You can work for the Bank of Zambia. You can work for yourself. 
Remember I said that you're getting a passport, eh? And uh, at uh, Zika's University, we're not giving a passport for you to just go and work. We're also giving a passport for you to work if you choose to, but also for you to start your own business. Is that clear? Because some of you maybe don't want to be someone's, uh, you know, saying sir to someone, eh? You want to be your own boss, eh? We'll give you that. We'll equip you. Because those programs that I've talked about and what my friends will also talk about, they have something unique, eh? Because uh, they give you the theory in different uh, uh, disciplines, but they also give you some knowledge that will allow you, if you want to use that passport, to go out on your own, to become your own boss, and bosses for others, you can do that. Allow me to say that I see a new potential graduates of Zika's University. By coming here, we know that we are treating you to the red carpet, meaning that already where you are, there is immense potential. And we think that we can help you to actually transform and translate into a graduate who will be useful to Zambia and to the Zambia's economy. For those of you that actually want to run enterprise, we have a degree to shape you up as an entrepreneur. Uh, it will take you four years to complete it. We have business administration. Uh, for some of you that want to be business administrators, business administration is um, a degree that stretches you a little bit into a general player because it accommodates finance, it accommodates human resource, it accommodates marketing, just about all the functions of business. And just in case you are thinking to be one, uh, we are going to help you to become a graduate. We have the Bachelor of Science in Marketing Management. So this is a specialized uh, degree for some of you that want to be marketing managers or marketing directors for companies such as Trade Kings, or such as Unilever, such as Colgate Palmolive, we are here to actually shape you up. In fact, my major, I'm not just HOD, I'm also a lecturer of, uh, of marketing, is a graduate of the Chartered Institute of Marketing and uh, uh, Greenwich Business School, Northampton Business School, and I'm also a graduate of the University of Zambia somehow. We also have a Bachelor of uh, Procurements and Supplies for some of you that want to specialize in procurement. So procurement opens up vast opportunities because you can end up being a buyer in a company. You can end up being, uh, you know, in stores to work in stores and so on and so forth, even distribution. For the masters, we have an MBA general I can actually say that maybe for this audience, you just want to know this for future information, but we have MBA, which is Master of Business Administration, Master of Business Administration, Business Leadership and Management Strategy, Master of Science in Procurement Logistics, and we are introducing a new program, Master of Science in Marketing, as well as an MCOM by Research and also a PhD. A PhD is a doctor uh, you know, of philosophy. So I would like to take this uh, moment to welcome you to Zika's University. And as I conclude, I just want to say that uh, one of the advantages of coming to Zika's University is that we have qualified lecturers. Uh, when I take an inventory, uh, lecturers here who are seated either as HODs uh, are either a doctor or have more than one master's degree. So this is unparalleled. Uh, we have qualified um, uh, lecturers here. And uh, I think my predecessor indicated that we are tier one university. Tier one is the highest ranking of a university in Zambia. What is there is we have got programs in human resource. And you know what it's there about human resource. You need it to manage companies with regards to the welfare of the employees. Human resource managers, if you are to be trained from here, just know that uh, you have got the quality of the qualification. We have got public administration. 
again, it's uh, another profession or which you, you cannot doubt, doubt about it. Especially, we are talking about the quality of the profession. The other thing that is there, the repute of the organization, the institution where you are getting. And we have got also the monitoring and evaluation. What is there is that uh, every project that is being managed, which is being done, without the people to monitor and evaluate the performance of uh, such an institution or, or the, uh, the program, which means that uh, you will not know on how to spend money. That's why this program of monitoring and evaluation, because of the investment of the money that is coming from the other organizations, then uh, you need to have this qualification. You know one thing that we should not doubt about? If you have got the experience, but you have got no qualification, then uh, you are not offering anything to the community. So even if you, you are a good farmer, but you don't know on uh, uh, how to do the concepts to do with the farming, they will be doubting you. But immediately when someone comes with a qualification, then they will be expressing that this is the person that knows. So if you are to monitor funding, money that is coming from the donors, you need to have a person with qualification. We have got the undergraduate and we have now developed another master's program of which we will be running soon. So what is there is there, these are the programs that we have got under management. Project management for at masters, we have got that, that and we have what particular modes are we using to deliver to the students? We have got the full time, uh, those who come during the day, up to 16 hours or 17 hours to the most. We have got also the part time for those who are working and they would just like to come for the classes in the evenings from uh, 17.30 to 20 hours, so it means they, they, have got, they have got also the benefit of coming to school if you want to have face-to-face -face classes, especially if you are working. We have got also the distance education. If you don't want to leave your home, anywhere where you, you, could, you would like to study from, uh, whether Kaputa, Chama District, and any other places, you can also be in class with the Zika's University you, and uh, one thing of a benefit to why Zika is also a preferred institution. What is it that we are doing, especially with the people who are from provinces? We have established centers in those uh, provinces. So it means that if you, if you don't want to come to Lusaka, unless if you want to come and see the uh, Cairo Road, but if you don't just want to come to Lusaka, but you want to continue and do your studies in Kaputa, in Chama District, we will be lecturing to you through Zoom, and then the, all the materials will be uploaded for you on the computer through the Zoom platform. And uh, when it comes to the tests or the exams, everything you do it from the provinces or the centers where you will be like to you, you like to sit for the for these exams. So we have uh, established all these, which are greater benefit. People who are in uh, Solwezi they don't need to come to Lusaka for the exams, which means that uh, they will not leave the office, they will be in the office working, but still getting the, level, the benefit of the lessons. And uh, the same lessons that are given to the full-time, same lessons and exams that are given to the part-time, same lessons that are given to the DE students, those are the greatest benefit that uh, Zikas is offering. So you have not made a mistake. For you to choose on Zikas, you have got more to gain if you are to enroll because of its repute, credibility of the institution, and also on how we are able to deliver to the market and how you will be acknowledged or be seen or be appreciated on the market once you graduate from here. We have three programs currently that we are offering. We are offering Bachelor of Economics, this degree is the foundation for those who want to move on to do masters and PhD in economics. We have another degree program, Bachelor of Economics and Finance. Now this is a double major. You specialize in two fields, economics and finance very useful for those of you who want to venture into 
banking at some point. We also have Bachelor of Development Studies. Bachelor of Development Studies is a degree that will offer you knowledge, detailed knowledge about development challenges. It's a degree that will enable you to go out there and solve developmental problems. Where do you get employed? Virtually everywhere. In government, NGOs, particularly in NGOs, they are looking for people with Bachelor of Development Studies. So this is something that you should consider as well. Now, why study at Zika's? At Zika's, you have lecturers who are qualified, but above all, experienced. People who have worked in industry, who know how economics is applied in industry. Those will be your teachers here. And from them, obviously, you are learning something very useful because you are not only learning academic, you are also learning how these concepts are applied in real life. So I welcome you to Zika's and I welcome you to economics department. I would like to see many of you, particularly the young ladies. Okay? Young ladies, we welcome you in economics field. Okay? It's high time that um, we produce a governor, Bank of Zambia, a lady from here. You know, Bank of Zambia governor job is reserved for economists. So please study economics and one day you become Bank of Zambia governor. Thank you very much. So why, why do you come to university? What is university? What does university mean? You are now entering an era of learning to teach yourself. So at undergraduate level, which is the level you are coming into, like I said, 80-20 rule. You go to masters, some of you will finish this degree, you do uh, an excellent job, and next you want to do masters. So at masters, when I'm teaching masters students, it's 90-10. So I only give 10%. The master's students have to do 90% of the work. That sounds daunting, right? But it's not. Once you get into the system and you uh, follow the, what we are telling you, uh, how to read and stuff like that, it becomes second nature. Okay? Then some of you will be standing in a few years You'll be standing where I'm standing. You'll be talking to young people. At the time, you may be a, a, a middle-aged person. You'll be talking to young people like I'm doing now. Okay? And from that point now, you move to PhD. Okay? You'll be here lecturing, so you need a PhD. Okay? And then PhD is 100%. Your supervisor just says, change this, change that, change this. But you have to know how to write. You have to know how to set out your work. Okay? So, if you didn't know, um, if your, 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 uh, your, your careers counselor didn't tell you, I'm telling you what to expect. Okay? Don't be daunted. Okay? Don't be afraid of this. It's not 80, 20. I don't think I'll manage. You'll manage very well. That's why we are lecturers. We know how to introduce you to these things and teach you the rules. And once you start using the rules, you become an excellent student. Everything revolves around computing nowadays. You are moving around with a computer in your pocket, your cell phone. And I think when you look back at our youngsters in the homes and look at how 
intelligent they are when it comes to dealing with gadgets, we are all potential computer scientists. <coughs> so I am a computer scientist. But when we talk of computing, I think people tend to think this is, you know, uh, a one area career. Computing is a very, very wide career. And let me, in case you didn't know, mention that there is a shortage of computer engineers amounting to 3 million worldwide. So in this country, it's an expanding you know, profession. And as a profession, this is why we now have uh, a professional body, just like the lawyers. We now have a professional body so that for one to practice, you need to have a certificate. As far as the uh, graduates from Zikas are concerned, we have a lot of computing graduates who are highly placed in the country. Wherever I've gone, I've met a Zikas ICT graduate. And they are highly placed. One of the things we notice is that uh, uh, industry tends to, you know, seek for uh, ICT graduates. We have a situation where every industry needs ICT graduates in one way or another. So talk of banking, talk of whatever has been discussed here in terms of uh, economics, in terms of uh, other areas, you still need a computer scientist in those areas. If we shut down our computers, imagine how things will be. Things will come to a complete halt. When we get home, we sit, we watch our TV and so on. Behind all that is a computer scientist. And coming to Zika's will make you into a computer scientist that will be sought after, you know, out there. So, um, to you who are here, I just want to encourage you, especially the girl child, you can do it, you can make it. Dr. Jerry was talking about um, courses that have to do with mathematics. They are there in computing, but it shouldn't be something that you should run away from. We have girls that are good in the STEM world, you know, that are girls that are good in sciences, that are good in math, and they can also do their best in engineering as well, and in the technical subjects. So to the boys and girls that are here, I encourage you to make Zika's, you know, your place of study, because just as Dr. Jerry mentioned, we, we, don't, we, not, we do not only teach you the theory aspect here, we teach you the practical aspect as well. You will learn how to code. You will learn how to develop various applications such that by the time you are done, you will be sorted after, like he said, because companies come here looking for students. At the same time, you can even do startups with your friends. We've had students teaming up with their fellow students and opening companies. So, um, being here is not a mistake. And if you wish or you desire to take a career path in information technology, you will not be wrong, especially to the girl child. I want to encourage the females here that you can do it. If I could do it, you can also do it. So do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid. Don't think the tech courses or science courses or engineering or mathematical courses are only for the males. No, they're for you as well. You can compete favorably with the male folk as well. So today, be encouraged and make those applications and come and learn the various degree programs that we have here. It would be good to see some of you standing today like me and testifying about Zika's University testifying of how you've made it through your journey in your career path as an IT specialist or as an IT expert. So um, to the girls especially, I'm so much interested in you, even after this, 
I would love us to have personal talks so that I could just drive you more and convince you to get into our school. To the guys as well, you are always, you always have a sort of upper age than the girls. So if you want to see me as well after school, we can still talk. I'm also interested in you, but I'm more interested in the girl child because I want to give them that drive because they can make it, they can do it. Sometimes all they just need is some encouragement, some love, some inspiration, and off they go. This university is not just a university of choice, but it's also the university of the future. Uh, we have invested quite a lot uh, in the staff. I think you have already interacted with some of the staff. We have also invested in uh, resources uh, in terms of uh, teaching uh, aids, in terms of um, uh, teaching platforms to help you uh, so that you understand the concept. We have um, invested in technology uh, so that it makes it easier. Uh, we offer highly applied programs. We have business. Uh, we have uh, ICT or computing. We also have the social sciences. And uh, there are some uh, programs that uh, you may be interested in. I'm sure you've been told that we are offering law, uh, we are offering uh, economics, uh, we are offering public administration, uh, we are offering accounting and finance, and uh, many other uh, programs. So please reflect and uh, you know come to this university we are i'm sure you've been told we are tier one tier one basically means we are the top-notch university in this country mm -hmm.